Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So I had a lot of requests on a post I recently posted on Twitter and Instagram asking you guys who you wanted to see me do a look on um, and who you thought I looked like. So I want to make this a weekly thing because I think it would be super fun um, to create like recreations of looks as well as my creations of looks. So because I upload now on Mondays and Fridays, I'm going to reserve one of those slots for one of the recreation looks. Um, however, for certain days and things like this, like this will be going up um, Wednesday, so today should be a Wednesday hopefully. Um, and, you know, if I do any vlogs and stuff like that, I'll probably put them on the in-betweens, like on a Wednesday and then have the makeup looks Monday and Friday. Just because I like to swap and switch, like, variety up and things like that, just to make it a bit more interesting. So, anyway, to the tutorial. Um, so, yeah, I really like what Kylie's doing at the minute. I think it's a really interesting look. It's very, like, simple, but very striking at the same time and very smoky, and I really like that kind of look. So... I'm going to try and recreate it for you guys, I hope you like it, and let's get on with it. So the first thing I like to do is take my nice sheer glow, and because it doesn't have a pump, I shake it, and then what I do is I take it from the top, so I'm just going to dab it into the top, and that seems to do the trick fine for now, and then just dab it onto my face. Um, I'm out... Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> I am rocking fake tan at the minute because I'm trying a new Saint Tropez tan, um, which I love at the minute actually, I've had a lot of compliments on it, so uh, yeah, I'm just going to be using my slightly darker foundation to match this. Okay, so that's foundation done. Um, now what I'm going to do is go straight in with the brows because Kylie has not necessarily full brows, but she does have defined brows, and in order for me to make sure I do this right, I'm going to do the brows first. So, I'm going to be taking my MAC um, Brow Pencil and Brunette. Um, I've really been liking this again, I've been going back to this a little bit at the minute, so... And now that we've done that, I'm going to go on to the eyes. And to start, I'm going to take the MAC Paint Pot in Constructivist. Now, this is going to work as a primer as well, but be careful because obviously it's more coloured than like Paisley or Soft Ochre, so it's going to show, so you have to be careful. Um, so I'm going to take this on my finger and then just blend this onto the lid and I'm going to smoke it out. <laughs> Round and just keeping it really soft and smudged um, and blended because that is the look she's wearing in the picture. Okay, so primarily she has um, a very smoky brown low lash line, so I'm going to take the same colour on like a bit of a bit of shading brush from Real Techniques and run that underneath the eye as well. You want to bring this quite far down. Um, because she does like a really smoky under eye and so do I and it's in trend at the minute as well so just give it a go and see what you think. Now I'm just going to go into the lid with the new L'Oreal um, Colour Riche Ombre Pure in Luminaire and just going to run this all over the lid. And as well underneath. Okay, so she tends to have a bit of a warmer shimmer onto the lid as well, just ever so slightly. Um, very effortless, but looks very put together at the same time. So I'm just going to run a bit of my tan pigment onto the lid. It's the most incredible colour ever. Um, so if you get the chance to go and swatch it in MAC at any point, do because it's my all-time favourite pigment ever. And it's just my holy grail one, so recommend to everybody. So I'm just going to run this on the inner part of the eye. 
Then I'm going to take a clean MAC 217 and just blend everything out a bit more. Okay, so Kylie likes to line, if you look, very, very closely to the bottom lash line, right on the actual lashes themselves, with some kind of brown or coffee pencil or something like that. So I'm just going to take dip down from MAC, it's the Fluid Line Liquid Line, and I'm just going to run this right underneath next to the lashes. I'm going to do the same thing on the top line. Okay, and now what I'm going to do is take my Shimura eyelash curlers and really curl my lashes because Kylie's lashes are super, super long and curled. Um, she does wear false lashes as well. I'm not going to in this look, but you could do if you really wanted to. Um, but I'm actually going out to this and I don't want to be rocking up with some crazy long lashes on. <laughs> but you can by all means pop lashes on if you want. Now for mascara, I'm going to be using um, my Barry M Lash Vegas Mascara. I absolutely love this mascara. Makes your lashes so long. And um, it's very easy to get off but lasts all day. I wouldn't say it lasts all day actually. That's probably a lie. It lasts probably about 60% of your day before you have to do a bit of a top up, but it's pretty good. I like it. I mean, personally I prefer to top up my mascara than pull on my lashes out trying to get it off, um, but it's personal preference. And don't forget to do the bottom lashes as well. It's really important. It will just really complete and finish off this look. Okay, now to actually finish off the face. I'm going to take my MAC bronzer in matte bronze. Um, Kylie really does like to bronze up her face, so we're going to really build on this um, from like the center of his eye outwards. Don't really bring it right into the cheek. Kind of like the way you would apply blush, to be honest. Don't forget to do here, and bring it down your neck if you have to. Okay, so now I'm just going to go in with my MAC uh, Mineralized Blush in Warm Soul. Um, I love this again for a frame rocking bronze look. Um, just apply this pretty much over where you applied your bronzer on your cheeks. It just adds such a nice warmth to the skin without it being too much, you know? You're already rocking your tan, so. So now to my favourite part, the highlighter. Um, this is Soft and Gentle by MAC. I love this highlighter, it's incredible. Um, I used this in my last tutorial, I had a lot of questions. I forgot to put it in the description box guys, I'm really sorry, but um, it was Soft and Gentle by MAC. So just run this um, onto the cheekbones, down the bridge of my nose. I like to go extreme just because I'm obsessed with dewy skin because I have quite dry, dull skin. So this really just adds a lot of life to my skin and stuff like that. Okay, so now for lips, I'm just gonna go ahead with MAC's Honey Love Lipstick. This is like the perfect Kylie look ever. So I'm just gonna apply this. It's like the perfect nudie, pinky, brownie kind of shade for um, Kylie's look. So guys, this is the finished Kylie Jenner look. I really hope you like it. I hope you enjoyed watching this tutorial. Even if you're not trying to recreate it, but just really like watching makeup tutorials, I really hope you did enjoy this. Um, she goes for a very light bronzy, brown, smoky kind of basic look, um, and a very smoky bottom lash line. I love this look. I think it's really, really me. I, I would wear this on a day-to-day -day basis. I think it's that fun and just simple and edgy. But let me know what your thoughts are in the description box below, and if you liked it, if you like Kylie Jenner, and if you have any more requests, for any more future tutorials every week then don't be afraid to just leave them down below or follow me on Twitter and Instagram and let me know on there too. So thanks so much for watching guys, I really hope you enjoyed this and I will see you next time. Bye!